The Liberal Party is stepping up its fight against Martin Hamilton-Smith, trying to convince voters in his seat to reject him the way he rejected his party. The campaign comes just a day after the Liberal defector took a spectacular swipe at the party he once led. The gloves are off in the seat of weight. Martin Hamilton-Smith betrayed us. We signed up for it to sign him in. As a Liberal, they've been deserted by what Martin's done. He's, he's ignored their wishes. David Ridgway marking his party's territory in Martin Hamilton Smith's Southern Adelaide electorate. I can be the local Liberal voice here until we have a candidate. Well, I'm glad to see Mr Ridgway out doing some work. Now, that's uh, a pleasant change. He's been out there in the, the upper house for the last decade or so, just, you know, Packing away the Zeds. That's a bit cheeky. I mean, that may be what uh, the Labor members of the Leadership Council do. Mr Ridgway is circling a petition calling on the defected Liberal MP to stand down. I voted for Martin as a Liberal member and he's sort of left the party, so I think it's time that we have a new representative. Well, that won't be happening. They voted for a Liberal. They still have a Liberal. A Liberal independent, to be exact. It's not the man we voted for. We voted for the party. And he's let the party down and he's let the voters down. I actually think that it's great that we, we in weight are being represented by a minister. There are three eyes in Martin Hamilton Smith and all of them are in play for the benefit of Martin Hamilton Smith. The Liberals say the fight for weight is far from over. They're confident voters won't accept Martin Hamilton Smith's defection in four years' time. That's despite there being 1,357 sleeps until the next election. Kim Robertson, Nine News.